Yo, what is up guys? Boldrix here, back with a brand new video. Where today, guys, we're going to be playing some My Pit Boost only. But before hopping into it, we have a little bit of a challenge today. I have never done anything like this on my channel before, so I am just super, super excited for today's video. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to click that subscribe button right now for me. And while you're at it, drop a like on today's video. Let's try to get to 1,500 likes, okay? If we can do it, I would be very, very happy. Thank you guys so much for supporting me, as always, of course. So, of course course like i said we have a challenge today okay and it's going to consist of a spinner okay i made a spin the wheel type of thing i guess i don't know i made a custom one of course and i have every single tower in the game on it all right i know there is a randomization button but that's boring okay the spin the wheel type challenge just makes it 10 times better i feel like and a lot more exciting as well okay i got this idea from jerome asf i believe that is his channel so thank you so much man he did this challenge on balloon cd6 and i was definitely inspired by that video to do it on balloon cd battle so let's just hop over into the spinner right now of course as you guys can see we have every single tower on the game or in the game i mean <laughs> so we're just gonna be spinning the wheel of course three times because it is boost only and we're just gonna be hoping for the best okay so let's spin it one time i'm hoping for a decent strategy boys please something good all right so we got the sniper at the first tower that's not bad okay not terrible whatsoever let's see what we can get next all right please 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 tax you let's go all right sweet i'm definitely down for that okay so let's see what we get as our third tower and glue all right obviously we have to end off with the glue okay so our camera detection is kind of weak to say the least boys because we only have the sniper um to pop the camo balloon so we have to watch out for group camos of course uh, but other than that we should be pretty fine so let's hop right into a game right now all right so i am mm, it's, this is like a five out of ten strategy okay i'm rating it five out of ten it could be worse it definitely could be a lot worse thank god that we have a little bit of camo detection that's a good thing because um, we could have none, and that would really, really suck, and then we would just die round 12. So it's taking quite some time to find this first opponent, so I'll catch you guys when we finally do. So we finally found our first opponent, Oof, with a smiley face. All right, boys, so my recording like happened to cut to, like, we had some technical issues because my computer froze. That's never fun, but anyways, we are going, what strategy again? It's glue, sniper, and the texture. Honestly, for a second, I could not remember, uh, but on a map like Yin Yang, I probably do not want to use this strategy on okay so i'm probably just gonna end up skipping this because he is not so yeah let's skip that okay i thought i missed that i was like no that would have sucked shallow river also not a decent map for the strategy okay thank the lord that he did skip that temple all right so this can definitely work out on a map like temple sweet 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 so of course like i said sniper tax shooter in the glue all right we probably will just avoid using the glue <laughs> we're probably just not gonna use it okay it's just not that good of a tower of course uh, but definitely will incorporate our tax shooter and our sniper quite a bit all right so of course we're gonna be starting off with eco on round two but our first tower is going to be our tax shooter all right so i'm going to place it down here right about here okay because we definitely do not want to be anti-stalling and anti-stalling if you do not know is popping the balloons right as they come out the map okay that is never 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 a good move if you are ecoing all right and i'm going to tell you guys right now uh why okay so the reason why is because if you pop the balloons right as they come out the map then the rounds are going to end a lot sooner all right and with eco you get your eco every six seconds okay your source of money every six seconds so obviously you would want the game to last as long as possible because the longer it is or the longer the rounds are the more money you're just going to have okay so definitely it is a really really bad thing to anti-stall you definitely do not want to do that so make sure that you set your towers uh not like all the way towards the back of the map i know on a map like this it's pretty close to the back of the map uh but just make sure that they're not right at the start okay and that's never 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 a good idea okay so of course we force an upgrade of a two three um tax shooter on his side he's going to be sending us some space blues right here so easily yeah we're just going to upgrade to the two three so we should be good with all of that and yeah so his farms are all right i guess oh my god he's gonna be aggressive with space eco definitely not a smart move okay he's wasting all of his money on these space pinks which he should instead be putting into his farms okay definitely 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 he was able to still get up uh another farm which is kind of surprising um but still i just don't think the space pinks were the move we barely even linked any lives actually too to that so uh we definitely are just looking really solid right now boys uh we are hopefully going to get to about 500 ish eco before round eight that's usually my goal that is a pretty decent amount if you do ask me uh, so yeah that's definitely what we'll shoot for boys uh but other than that we're just gonna continue on with our eco and go from there 
he's going to be able to defend against pretty much all of this eco as well even with that single tax shooter i know he's going to have to eventually build up another one though here in a second um, because the greens will override him just a little bit so we definitely will see if he happens to upgrade he just did go for the plantation though so he definitely knows what he's doing uh with the farming situation and there he goes with the wizard okay so whiz tack definitely a common strategy uh not on a map like this though. i don't normally see whiz tack on a map like this but i like it okay it's definitely different and unique okay i always like something that's different all right so we have 528 529 eco i think we just chill for now okay honestly because we have a lack of cabinet detection i think our best bet is to chill for now okay so i'm just gonna chill um with this two three tax shooter if he happens to come at me with some yellows it's gonna be an easy easy defend all we have to do is upgrade to another maybe just even a two zero and we'll be good depending on how many yellows he sends us okay uh so we already have twenty one hundred dollars as well so that is super super nice for us his farms honestly are pretty good too like it kind of pains me because they're pretty good okay he definitely knows how to farm um so props to him on that he did never upgrade though that one farm to the more banana so oh wait never mind he just did okay so here it comes at us with some yellows uh so of course let's just upgrade this to two zero very quickly it looks like he's not gonna stop so i'm just gonna get quickly up a two three and we're gonna be good with all this okay so he just wasted so much money on this just i can't believe he has that much money that is a ridiculous amount of money. He just sent us so many yellows right there, boys. Like, that was insane, all right? So, he already has a lot of detection, of course, on his side. We, on the other hand, do not. Uh, so, what I'm going to do is get up this um, sniper up here. What we're going to do is set it to strong, of course, because we want it to popping uh, those leads. And there we go. It's already popping the leads. Cool, cool, cool. That's very, very nice for us. Uh, should we be a little bit aggressive with, like, a regen rush? Just a little bit, okay? Just a little bit. I just want to force an upgrade or two, hopefully. Um, and he actually did go for that farm. Wow, okay. So he's going to be leaking some lives here. <gasps> he boosted? No freaking way, boys. Okay, so he might be coming at us with something. I'm a little bit nervous. I'm a little bit nervous. All right, so we're going to set the strong still, I guess. Oh, my gosh. Okay, should we all out him right here? Should we just do it? Oh my god, please kill him, please kill him, please kill him, let's go! <laughs> we won, boys! We freaking won, we forced the round 11 boost, therefore he was not gonna have another boost active for my all-out rush, and it happened to kill him. Obviously, as you guys could see, I sent a little bit of regen rainbows at first, so he would think to maelstrom, but then behind it, I sent a lot of camos, he had a lack of camo detection, and that is just a GG. So, I will catch you guys in the next one. Wait, 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 before we go into the next one, I completely forgot we get to spin the wheel once again all right so let's go over back to our wheel and let's spin this bad boy three more times all right so let's hope for something a little bit better are we okay i thought that was the glue again that was super super close but we got the ice okay so i'm happy with that ice is a pretty good tower of course let's see what we can get next oh uh, my god it's always the glue what is this it's literally always the glue boys so glue ice oh my gosh we were so close boys so <laughs> close to getting village Glue Ice Village would have been terrible. And if I would have won, then, dude, that would have been very, very funny. But we're going to be hopping to this game. I guess we're not going to make a cut unless it takes a very, very long time um, to find that opponent. Never mind. Did not. Okay, so Revival is our opponent, boys. He looks pretty good. All right, so I'm a little bit nervous. But Wizard Ice, that's a good combo. The glue, once again, not too good. Okay, I'm sorry to um, dog on the glue, but we all know. We all know about the glue, boys. Okay, so we got the map Riverside, which I probably will end up skipping. He's pointing at me, I believe leave oh never mind okay i thought he was pointing at me to skip it i was like nope uh but never mind he did ready up so we're gonna have to oh no hydro dam is not gonna work out for us bros no <laughs> no i want riverside back oh my lord this is not gonna work out boys oh my lord okay so we have to go wizard ice glue oh no this is a hundred percent a boat map boys i don't know how to feel about this all right if we win this game if we win this game, boys, that would be absolutely crazy, all right? So, we're going to be starting off, of course, with the wizard. Um, and he's going to be farming, which is definitely, obviously, a very, very good start. You should always farm on a map like this. Always, always, always farm on a map like this. Um, so, yeah, I'm just going to hope for the best, boys, okay? So, we're going to be coming at him with some reds, of course. And he's going to probably be building up a boat. 
most people go boat on this map because it's just super super good and yeah here he comes uh with some space blues as well so he just wants to get some leaks off of us which i guess is a smart move okay that's fine uh we're gonna have to eventually upgrade to this lightning once we can we did force the um grape shot upgrade on his side so that's a good thing um but he's saying well done and stuff oh my lord i'm sorry i'm trying to do a challenge man i'm literally so sorry but wow like i got screwed over with a map like hydro dam like it's just super super hard uh to use a non-bow strategy on a map like this boys like definitely and i was so late to these blues oh my lord what am i doing boys okay so let's start to send some blues of course he's gonna have to oh my gosh all right so yeah let's boost some blues over top of this he's gonna be leaking some lives right here boys like definitely so i'm gonna be sending some space pinks over top as well i'm gonna see how he reacts um i know it's not that smart for our eco wow he actually defended very nicely <laughs> he barely leaked i thought he was gonna leak way more than that okay and he's giving us the face palm that's not cool what i'm sorry man i'm sorry that i'm using the strategy i'm sorry once again oh my goodness okay so we're gonna continue eco in so it kind of wasn't that smart i mean it's smart and not at the same time uh to send a rush like that um it did force an upgrade or two on his side so like that's a good thing oh my gosh are you serious okay so what we want to do is set this to the last actually oh my god he's literally not going to stop with these <laughs> he's literally not going to stop with these boys oh my god we're down to 57 what is this what is this oh my god we have the freaking boost literally oh my god this strategy is so bad we're down to 14 really we were so high in lives right there we're still leaking how we just boosted boys what even man okay he's probably gonna come at us with a a little bit of a rush on round eight so i am definitely not excited for that but we have 400 eco so i guess that's a good thing but yeah here comes the regen rush i i definitely expected this and oh my god we're we're dead boys we're dead we're literally dead if we can't boost oh we're dead dang it <laughs> all right so i'm just gonna keep that in the video because like why the heck not but like wow definitely a very very unfortunate map for a strategy like that so ggs nonetheless i will catch you guys in the next game but before doing that let's go back to our really good wheel of course it's very good because we got glue twice in a row obviously so please anything but glue anything but glue i'm just hoping for literally anything but glue okay super monkey <laughs> we're not gonna be able to use it dude oh my god unless we go super super late game i doubt we're gonna be able to use it okay so we got the super monkey we got dart monkey all right so that's good all right at least we got dart let's see what else we can get boys please something good and we got the tax shooter all right so not bad not bad so dart tack super monkey okay i'm definitely down for this let's hop into another game of course and just hope for a more fortunate game in <laughs> a map too like man that freaking map is definitely a boat map hide your damn 100 percent always go boat on a map like that or at least sub something along the lines of a water tower definitely not wizard ice glue that was not the move whatsoever okay so we finally found our next opponent wreck that good all right so obviously he looks really good uh but at least we have a decent strategy we got the map cards which i'm kind of down for um hmm should we go it yeah let's do it okay i'm gonna be playing on cards of course and we're gonna go dart tack oh no not farm okay super monkey and yeah we're probably not gonna be using the super monkey we might we might okay we go a little bit late game we definitely can incorporate uh this super monkey but other than that we probably won't be doing anything with it okay so uh we're gonna be starting off hmm we can either start off with the darts or the texture right so i mean it could work either way uh, but i might just start off with the texture right it's a pretty good start in tower of course i'm gonna be sending it like right about here okay so there we go i would be upgrading it to obviously the two zero for now and he's going to be starting off with a farm in the dart monkey okay definitely a common strategy for this map dart farm ace or dart farm wizard okay so i'm expecting that right off the rip um but let's of course start our eco off with a bunch of group reds okay so like I said, of course, we're going to be shooting for about 500-ish eco before round 8. Uh, you guys already know that. Let's also upgrade to this 2-3 right here because he was sending me a little bit of eco, which I don't understand that move whatsoever. But, I mean, I guess, like, it just forces an upgrade, which I'm going to eventually upgrade anyways. Um, so I guess it's just better to do it sooner than later, maybe. I'm not entirely sure. But uh, let's continue our aggression with these reds, of course. And then we're going to be sending him some blues. I doubt he greets this, but if he does... I don't think it's smart. Oh, he's going to greet it. Never mind. He's going to greet it, okay? Because he's already sending down his tax. Uh, so I just don't think that's a good move whatsoever. We're going to be boosting some blues at him, actually. Yep. Let's boost some blues now. Because he literally has no money. 
Oh my goodness. All right. And I'm not, I'm literally not even going to send any space pinks over top. Okay. I just wanted to boost some blues uh, just for him to use all of his spikes and whatnot. Wait, I swear he used way more spikes. What? I swear he used like five sets of spikes right there. He definitely didn't because it's boost only, but that, that just seemed a little bit fishy. Okay. So uh, we're looking pretty strong. Of course, he's chasing super, super hard right now. He's probably going to be leaking um, to this round five AI lured over with the greens. Uh, so that's a good thing. And all we're going to be doing is just continuing our aggression uh, with our eco. Obviously, it's doing very, very nice for us right now. If he's smart, he's going to be sending us some space blacks next round. So I'm definitely going to be expecting something. Oh my God. Did he really just go for that farm right there? All right, so we're gonna continue on with the greens. I'm not gonna boost them because he has quite a bit of money, okay? So he's gonna be able to get up another triple dart here relatively soon. Um, and he's actually gonna get up a spike bolt, okay? So that spike bolt spot, I don't like that spot. Uh, that's way too far back in the map, in my opinion. Holy crap, he's down to 81 lives, boys. He's leaking lives left and right down to 66. What if we happen to kill him? I mean, we're not going to, but that would be pretty funny, honestly. So we have 512 eco. Wow, we are just looking super, super solid right now. Um, so we're going to stop ecoing here in a second. I'm going to eco one more time, one last time. And uh, there we go. So 553 eco is going to be our eco amount. That's pretty good. Pretty good. I'm happy with that 100,000%, okay? Um, so if he happens to send us some yellows next round, which I doubt it, um, because he just went for that plantation. But if he does, all we have to do is upgrade to either a spike pole or another two, three tax shooter. We can do a lot of different things, okay? I probably will just go the spike pole route. So, oh my gosh, there was a lot of lag right there. Okay, wow. Okay, wow. That's that's not fun. All right, that's not fun. So let's just clean up those down there. Oh my god. Okay, so like my thing, like my notification center thing pulled down. I was, I was trying to place that spike pool, so that's never fun. But it's all good. Okay, it, it's all good. It's fine. Uh, so what we're going to do, of course, is upgrade this to the jug. Might as well just already, you know what I mean? Oh my god, did he just greet that? Literally, he just greeted that. Wow. That was very, very greedy. He's lucky that his jug's in the back of the map. So, like, I could see how it's smart in a situation like that. But other than that, I don't think it's smart. Okay, so we want these on strong, I guess, because he is just sending us regens left and right. That's never fun. That is literally never fun. Oh, my God. Is he really doing this right now? No way we're dead to this. We're not dead to that. But, like, wow. That was super aggressive right there. <laughs> that was so aggressive. What? I don't understand that at all. So we're going to be sending him some space to eco again, or not again. I mean, this is the first time we play this dude. He already built up a triple dart, dude. <laughs> All right. So yeah, let's just continue on with the space to eco. We have 605 eco. So that's a good amount. Um, I feel like he's going to be aggressive again. He's not building up farms right now. He, oh my gosh, what the heck? All right. So we're going to be able to defend against all of that. I don't understand your aggression. Okay. Let's send him some uh, group pinks now. We might as well max Deco because he just does not have any money to rush us, really. Uh, we can Maelstrom, of course, if we need to. Um, but, yeah, I'm a little bit nervous, just a little bit. We have 712 Eco, though, before round 15. So that definitely is pretty good. He just upgraded that farm. Oh, my gosh. He's just not. I feel like he's going to be aggressive towards us, boys. Like with the camo ceramic, maybe, or something. You can put these back onto first. Yeah. Okay. We only have one on first. So my dart spots are, like, kind of just all over the place. I'm not going to lie. Uh, but whatever. So... Oh, are you kidding me? Oh my god. I'm just going to boost that. Like, that is a humongous rush. Jesus. That was such a big rush. That was, like, such a waste of money. He has, like, literally no farms right now. Okay, let's continue to space deco because he might just re-rush us. So, I'm going to watch out for that. If he does, cool, I guess. I don't really know. But I'm getting up spike pulls just to be safe. Or, or potential spike pulls, of course. Uh, let's continue our spaced eco because we have 850 eco which is not bad uh, but his farms are just not good literally they're just not good i could be aggressive with the mob right here too i might on round 19 literally might because that would literally force him to sell a lot of his farm so that would be super super nice for us oh my god that's a nicely timed rush right there i'm not gonna lie um yeah i knew the camel was gonna be in there please defend okay like i knew the camel was in there i knew the camel was in there um, <laughs> but I had to maelstrom that very quickly. Uh, so that's fine, I guess. Let's uh, continue on with our pinks, I guess, because we need to get to at least a thousand eco right here, boys. Okay. So if we hit a thousand, then I'm happy with that. Oh my God. Again. Okay. So we should be fine with all this. Oh my God. I did not mean to boost that. I did not mean to boost that. He just boosted though as well too. 
Oh my gosh, did not mean to boost that. So he's probably going to be coming at us with <laughs> a BFB, which is completely and utterly understandable. I literally only have darts in the map right now. I just got rid of my tax shooters. So I hope he comes at me with a BFB, actually, because he literally has no money right now. He has no money. He only has three plantations right now, and our defense is actually kind of good, okay? So we can definitely fan club if needed, and he died to the AI. Let's go! Let's freaking go, boys! Oh my gosh, very anticlimactic to say the least, but I'm just so happy that we won that game. So GG's. I'm gonna hop into one more game, so let's back out of this. Let's go back to our wheel, and let's spin it three more times, all right? So let's... That, that strategy was pretty good, okay? I cannot be mad with that. Dart Monkey again, okay? So there we go. We got the Dart Monkey once again. Let's see what we can get next. Hmm, mortar. Okay, mortar. We were so close to banana farm. We we're so close. That's fine. So dart mortar and then ninja. Okay. Alrighty. Let's go. Okay. Dart mortar ninja. I like this. I like this. Okay. So we'll be hopping to this. Lane Zalot is our last opponent, boys. 75 wins, 63 losses. Um, so he's kind of experienced, of course. He has 300,000 medallions, okay? So I just feel like this guy knows what he's doing. He's actually not ranked bad on the, on the leaderboards currently, okay? So that's pretty good. So Snowy Castle is the map, and he's giving us the shocked face. I will send you hearts, okay? Because I'm a nice person, I guess. <laughs> so Snowy Castle could work out, but is it the move? Is it the move? Um, no, it's not. Okay, we're gonna be skipping that. I just don't feel like it's gonna work out too well for us. Okay, so mound pass. Yikes, that is definitely not what I was expecting, but that's fine. Okay, so thank the lord that he did happen to skip that map. Okay, Wizards Keep. So, not the map I was expecting or wanted, but it can still work out for us, okay? I can't be too upset. So, I guess I'm going to put my dart in the first position, then I'll put my mortar, and then I'll put my ninja in the last position. Okay, so dart, mortar, ninja, let's hop right into this one, boys. Okay, so, um, I don't know. I'm kind of iffy with this strategy. Uh, at least we have the mortar, and of course, the mortar is super, super good on a map like this. So, I can't complain too hard, okay? I definitely cannot. Um, so, we're going to be starting off with the mortar as our first tower as well let's place it right in the middle of course let's get up the rapid fire and it kind of sucks that we are anti stalling just a little bit kind of um i don't know entirely how to feel about that but like it's hard not to on a map like this to be honest with you guys because like the start is like right there this map is so short okay so uh let's of course start off with all of these root reds and his boat is already set to last or not last but it's already chasing quite a bit uh so definitely should set it to last because if he doesn't he's gonna be leaking quite a bit of lives to say the least and it looks like he does not have it to last okay so he's probably gonna have to upgrade to the fastest shooting if he goes for the next farm before round four that definitely will not be a good move for him because he's gonna be chasing super super hard to the blues i might even boost him if he happens to go um for those but i doubt he does okay so yeah these rounds are kind of fast boys oh my gosh my mortar man stop being so good man i'm kidding okay but he did upgrade to another grave shot actually i really like that move um so what we're gonna do here is get up the burning stuff actually perfect timing too because he's sending us some space pinks right now um so for the most part we should be pretty good um i don't mind a few space pinks here and there we still have 137 lives so we definitely are big chilling right now boys okay so um our game plan hmm we can get up for round 13, we're probably going to have some spike pulls and then maybe a 2-3 mortar, or a 3-2 mortar, I believe, actually. Sorry about that. Uh, we also need the signal flare, I guess, just to have the camera detection. I mean, it's not too big of an issue because our ninja is going to have camera detection, so that's nice. I just don't see ourselves defending if we do go the ninja route, okay? I think the spike pull route, spam and spolt, is going to effectively help us a lot, okay? So, um, here come more greens in the ai i just saw myself leaking here uh for a second but i guess we're good for the most part so we're at 455 eco that's a decent amount okay i can't be upset about that if you were to send us some space blacks right now that definitely would probably hurt us okay i'm not gonna lie boys so thankfully he's not up oh. uh, karma karma man okay so what we have to do here is um let's set down all of our spikes very quickly let's get up a dart very quickly as well we literally have no money boys oh my gosh okay so uh, that should help us a little bit, and he actually did stop sending. Okay, so 492 eco, not good, okay? Not good that much, but at least his farms are good, okay? His farms really aren't that good, so that's a good thing. Um, we can set down our spool, like, right about here, I guess, is going to be a good spot. Mm, right about here. Okay, so what we're going to do is get that spooled up. We're going to put it to last, okay? We're not going to build it up yet, 
but I have it set to last, of course. I feel like that's going to be the best targeting for it. Other than that, yeah, we're gonna get up another two, or not another, but another mortar, but we're gonna upgrade to the three, two, because that's gonna be super, super good for us. And yeah, oh, what the heck? Okay, so he just sold his buccaneer to go for a destroyer. All right, cool, cool, cool. Uh, we could just start to get up this mortar right now, I guess, in case he's aggressive on round 11. So yeah, the big balloon buster, 3-2 right here. Oh, let's get up this, of course, too. So this should be quite an easy defend. Thankfully, 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 we upgraded right there. <laughs> I, I just felt the need to do it. I just thought he was going to be aggressive, and definitely that was a good freaking call, boys. Okay, so let's start to space equal a little bit, of course, because we want to save a little bit of money, I guess, just in case. Okay, you never, never know. Okay, so he thinks that I'm going to rush him. That definitely is not happening. His farms are just not good, just like the last opponent. Like, the, these guys need to focus on their farms. Like, they, they forget that they have no money. I, I don't know. <laughs> you just definitely have to make sure that you have a decent amount of farms, especially in those later game rounds, because money is everything in this game, of course. Um, it's not rocket science, okay? So, uh, we're still space equal, and of course, we have 594 eco. He has shown really no signs of aggression currently. I'm going to set this strong, by the way, this dart monkey, in case he sends me a um, ceramic. I feel like he's going to. Um, so, we're going to start grouped eco in here, actually, right now. So, let's do it right now. And we're going to get up our eco a little bit, of course. We're act actually at 717, so that's pretty good. Um, I thought that was about to force an upgrade, too. I could easily send, like, a lead rush right now, possibly get a boost out of him, too. Uh, but I just don't feel like that's going to be necessary, and I don't think that's the right move because I do not want to be wasting my money, okay? Uh, we're at 774 eco, and I should be max ecoing, man. I should have, like, sent, like, a grouped red or something. <laughs> so we're at 807 eco right now. We do not have that good of uh mob popping power defenses okay wait what the heck is this rush that's a super easy defend um i definitely just saw that ceramic so nice try with that um but wow we still are gonna leak some lives i guess that's fine okay for the most part we were good so let's space eco once again because we literally have like no defenses right now holy crap okay we're gonna have to get more darts on the map like a freaking sat boys okay so let's just get up some zero zeros at least uh just to be safe i just feel like a mob's gonna be coming to us yep Yes, it is. Okay, so let's just boost that. Let's sell this, actually. Okay, so please defend that. Okay, so we defended that. With a boost, though. So that kind of sucks. We don't have that much money, boys! Ah, I don't know how to feel about this. Oh, my God, I'm a little bit nervous. Okay, if he does come at us with a rerush, uh, yeah, here it comes. Oh, my God, I'm going to have to sell so many darts. Holy crap. All right, so we can fan club there, I guess. I was thinking about either going to... Oh, my God. That's so many. Oh, my God. So, hopefully, we can defend against that. Oh, my God. She's not stopping with the leads, boys. Okay. So, what we need to do here, get this mortar again. The 3-2, of course. Okay. So, we're good. All right. We're good. It's probably going to be coming at us with a maybe BFB, possibly, if he does. I don't know how to feel about that. We just, we're gonna have to fan club straight up. Okay, so I guess we're gonna need to start space equaling. Our eco is not good right now. We're only at 867. What? Okay, we're dead probably. Oh uh, no, we're gonna die. No. No. Oh my God, we can't even pop off the lair, man. Wow, I should have fan club there. Oh my god, we had no money whatsoever, man. Oh my gosh, that was definitely our game to win. But I guess, you know, everybody takes L's, okay? I'll accept that L with pride. GG, my friend. So that is going to wrap up the video. I hope you guys really did enjoy. I thought it was a really, really fun video. I showed some losses as well because obviously some of these strategies weren't the best, okay? I mean, like that strategy, I can't complain. It wasn't too bad, but of course, I would definitely go like Boat Boomer Farm or some over that strategy any day of the week. But like I said, I hope you guys did enjoy. Make sure to drop a like if you didn't. Also, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to click that subscribe button. So the last question I asked you guys in the last video was, what was different with the last video? Okay, so I saw like all sorts of answers, man. But what I was thinking of specifically was my profile skin, okay? If you guys did not notice, I changed it, all right? But I also saw a lot of people saying, oh, you turn on the skins. And I'm like, shoot, I did, okay? So that is also a good point. So I was gonna be putting up a random comment on the stream that uh, said something about something that was different, okay? So this guy won, congratulations, man. I just feel bad, man. Like, I literally do because I was like, shoot, I did change my skins. I did this, I did that differently. Like, all these different things, okay? So I hope you did enjoy your shout out, man. Congratulations. So the next question I'm gonna be asking you guys is, what challenge did we do in today's video? If you do not get this answer right, then wow. <laughs>
<laughs> literally why because it's in the title of this video so make sure to leave your answer down below in the comment section and you may have the chance to win a shout out in the next video which is obviously dope i hope you boys did enjoy once again it's been your boy Botrix or justin peace out everybody